What's up YouTube? So today I'm starting out my day super early. I gotta spray paint this thing and I'm doing it super early just because I gotta spray paint and I don't want anyone thinking I'm gonna tag up the school. And I'm actually gonna go to a place I've been wanting to go to. Today I'm gonna have a pretty cool day. I'm gonna go to Silverado and I'm gonna go to this library and I'm pretty sure you guys will think it's pretty cool. So this is what it looks like. It's actually red down here. It's not all that great looking, but gotta do what you gotta do. So I know my vlogs have been kind of crappy lately, so that's one of the reasons why I'm going out and doing something kind of interesting. I mean, I'm not just doing it for you guys. This is actually a place I've been wanting to go to for a while. Because no matter how many people say, oh, your vlogs are fine. I mean, I feel like people are getting over just the fact that I've been skating that one school so much. I was like, dude, I gotta do something cool just because I really do want all my audience to be pleased with what they watch. Sorry if I'm not going to be able to do the best game, but I'm doing this for you guys. Like, keep in mind that I'm still hurt, but I want to make my videos as good as possible, so I'm going to try to do that today. Part one on my to-do list is complete, though. So right now I'm at Starbucks. I'm going to chill here for a bit. It feels weird vlogging with an iPhone because it's my first time, actually. And this looks really good. I haven't had Starbucks in a while. But yeah, I'm going to chill here for a bit. Then I'm going to head to Silverado, so part two on my to-do list is done. I right, just arrived to Silverado Park. You know, this beautiful park. It's a small park, but it's so fun. I don't think I'm gonna do that much skating, my ankle hurts, and I actually dropped my board on my ankle, so it made it worse. It felt like my bone was about to stick out like last time. You guys probably know the story if you guys have been a long time viewer of mine. If you guys don't know, this is a ledge I messed up my ankle on. This tiny ledge right there. I literally just messed up on a 5-0 from this. I did it first try, and then the second one, it just went boom, took a slam. I will 5-0 you today, though. I have to. If I don't, I'm gonna cry. So yeah, if I only end up doing easy tricks, I'm so sorry. Like tricks that most people can do, like 50-50s and 5-0s like that. I just don't know if I can skate, so I'm really sorry. Wow, easily one of the best solo sessions I've had in such a long time. I think I actually hit every single obstacle. I even hit flat ground for you guys, which is called bounce skateboard. I know my heel flip was rocky. One of the crooks I tried, I landed really bad on my ankle. So that's why I just didn't want to try anymore. Because nose grind and the nose grind and the the bounce skateboarding were the last tricks I did. And it was really hard because the crook was the third to last trick I tried and it hurt so bad. I think I should have done the easy tricks first, I don't know why. The hardest one was the nose gun for sure. With the weak ankle, with the weak ankle, it's hard to pop up that high. I learned pop shit at 50 50s. I've never done that. And not only that, I did pop shit at 50 50 back 180. And I was trying to film that for a video part, but now I'm not gonna do it because it's gonna be on here and it's not gonna be a surprise when you guys see it. Surprisingly, it wasn't that hard. This park's actually becoming like one of my favorite skate parks, so I think I'm gonna start coming here more often. I'm gonna hit up NK too because um, he's a pretty, he's pretty chill. You know, you guys saw one of my vlogs with him. If you guys um, want to see that, click the bubble thing right there. Oh, and it made me so mad that I did the 5 0 so easily. I did like 20 of them in a row. I mean, I only showed one in the clip, my best one probably. But I'm just like, dude, what the f- uh, Like, I can't wait. I got injured for a month from a 5 0 on that tiny ledge back there. Uh, life, man. The smallest things can get to you, man. It's, it's really trippy. You don't know what to ever expect. Okay guys, this is the moment you guys have all been waiting for. Look at this big book. I mean, this is for like Godzilla or something. I saw all those clips. After looking over my Switch slash Nolly heel flip, I'm like, damn, what the heck? I didn't know they were that high. Just as well as my Nolly flip, I'm like, whoa, I didn't know I had that much pop for my Switch and Nolly tricks or whatever they can be because I don't know about the heel flip. This is really cool. So if you don't like vlogs where it's just me alone, I feel like the vlogs with my friends and I are funnier, but the one by myself are more artsy and 
there's more work into it, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's more artsy shots and there's better places I go to. I feel like it's more adventurous while I'm alone, but with my friends it's more like just chilling. It's, there's just more jokes into it, but I don't know which one you guys like more. Before this, I had in and out I didn't film that because why would you guys want to see that? Not much to say, I did a couple tricks. I was trying to do more tricks, but I didn't know there's this light pole right here. Um, I wanted to do some tricks down this thing, and then that one has like skate stoppers, so yeah, I'm a wussy. They shouldn't be able to stop me because I'm Chuck Norris status, you know, but Asian. I'm just kidding. So I didn't vlog once I got home. I need to finish editing and uploading a video for tonight, which you guys have probably already seen if you guys have been subscribed within like two or three weeks. I just took off the tape from the, you know, this thing. It was red, and then look, it bled through. I think I'm just going to spray paint the whole thing black. Hope you guys liked the vlog. I actually tried to make it as entertaining as possible by myself. Yeah, so I'm just trying to make up for a lot of the vlogs, you know, because a lot of the past vlogs have just been at the same spot and I'm pretty sure you guys have probably been bored of it. Unless you guys like me, then it doesn't matter. But, you know, some people care about like, dude, why do you always do the same thing? So I'm like, dude, I gotta go do something else. And then for me too, I'm like looking at the footage, I'm like, why am I doing the same thing? You gotta always progress, you know what I'm saying? I think after this, I'm just gonna go to house church or something. I'm not really sure. I would film with them, I would like to film with them, but we're just not that comfortable. Like, I'm homies with some of them, but just putting the camera on their face is just no bueno. No bueno means no good if, you know, if you don't speak Spanish or something. Thanks for those who made it this far into the video. I was really stoked on this video, just the way how it came out and how I spent this day. So I was like, hmm, I should do a sticker giveaway. I haven't done those in a really long time, and I don't know if you guys would like it, but I know there are people out there who'd be down for it, so... All you gotta do is like and comment your Instagram username and something nice or a hey, hate comment if you guys want to. I prefer not, but I mean constructive criticism is good. So I mean if you guys wanna hey go for it. If you don't have an Instagram, you can just comment, oh I wanna be entered in the giveaway, but I don't have an Instagram and whatever you wanna comment and I'll make sure you guys are entered. I'll pick the winner in a week. Or maybe five days or something, something like that, just because my parts are gonna be uploaded next week. Yeah, I mean don't expect anything crazy from that video. <laughs> I don't know if you guys noticed, but this is like my only vlog where I actually filmed myself like, you know, messing around and stuff like on the books and stuff. Or actually, I'm not sure because I haven't looked over the clips and this is like after two weeks, I think. I'm catching up with the vlogs, by the way, so don't even trip, guys. You know how John Hill films himself like cruising through parks and, you know, hanging around on structures and buildings and stuff? I really been wanting to do that, but um, I mean, not because of him. But I've been not doing that just because I really hate it when people are like, Oh, you copy John Hill or something. And I'm like, dude, he's inspirational. But the reason I make my vlogs the way they are are not because of him. The guy that actually inspired me to make vlogs the way they are are actually Roy Wasabi. Um, John Hill is inspirational, but his videos aren't the reason why I make my videos the way they are. I mean, no hate to John Hill. He's freaking sick, man. So, so if you guys would be down to see that kind of stuff. Um, let me know and yeah always like comment subscribe. Thanks you. Peace out